Hi, welcome to this tutorial. So in this tutorial, we are going to be looking at how to extract your numbers from a string in JavaScript. So this is going to be a complete tutorial where we are going to be looking at a lot of methods of doing this. Mainly, we'll be working on two solutions. One that extracts the string without the numbers into a variable so we can use it later. The other solution will extract just the numbers into an array so again we can use it later so these are the two main solutions we are going to be working towards but each of these solutions are going to have multiple methods of achieving the same all right so let's go right into it then so i have my i have a folder and i have a project right here just for the purpose of this particular lesson so there is a html with its basic skeleton like this and the title says javascript practice and i have an extension a live server extension which you can use you can just search for this and you'll get the live server extension that you need this one this one is the one i'm using you can use anything you want all right so let's first look at the html skeleton so that's this pretty much it this is all the skeleton okay so and next i'm gonna be i'm gonna i've connected my script js to this right so i'm just gonna go in here and i'm gonna first use the string replace method this is basically for removing the numbers so remove the numbers from the string and just have the string in here so with all of these examples we are going to be using something called regular expressions right so here to start with we are going to give a condition that says replace every digit 0 to 9 replace all the digits 0 to 9 with empty space so when you replace it by empty space what happens is it it becomes like it was never there so essentially it's removed okay so this will essentially remove these digits from the string without a trace so in regular expressions, you can use something called slash black backslash D to denote this. And you can use the G flag, which is the global flag to denote that you want to remove these digits throughout the string. So global basically means globally throughout the string. So if you don't use the global flag, what would happen is it would just remove the first instance, just the first digit, first instance or first occurrence of that particular character or digit and the rest of it would just be that. Okay, so that's not what we want. We want the entire list of numbers to be removed from the string, right? So you can use something like this. All right, so now that we've discussed this, let's just go ahead and create it. So I'm going to use a prompt for this, enter the string. Now why? Because, well, you know, I'd like to give... A little bit of autonomy to my users you can you can do it either way so let's say I do a console.log that says original string okay not like this I'm using the template string original string is str now all right so next what I'm gonna do is str is equal to str dot replace like this and remember i said i was using regular expressions right now unfortunately the thing is i won't be able to explain regular expressions in detail for you because it's a huge topic okay so i i won't be able to explain it for you so i'll just explain what i'm using so regular expressions have to be placed within your front slashes like this and within that remember i said you have to place what needs to be removed so slash t which means remove everything from zero to nine now if i just do it like this only the first number would be removed now if i add a g right after the regular expression is completed which means i've added the global flag to this that means all of the numbers would be removed that's it right so but what's what's this i'm just giving i have a replace i know what i want replaced but what do i replace it with so the next argument you have to give is your empty string. See, it's just two quotes. It could be double quotes or single quotes without anything in between. So don't place any space in between or anything. And next, let's do another console.log. And in here, let's say, see, and also remember that I've reassigned this back to str. Now that's because if I do it like this, just like this, what would happen is it would create a new copy. Okay, so str is still 
not uh, you know it won't be changed so if you want to change actually if you want to actually change str you have to place it inside of your str again reassign it again so in here replaced string um, or something like that is again str because we've actually reassigned it now see i have my prompt let's say i open it with like this let's go for it now if you go and look look at your console.log you should see the output see original string says this and the replace string is just hello and i can do the same with multiple strings as well oh, no, not like this something like this see it works on multiple words as well so it works perfectly so that's it that's how you remove numbers from a string so you can use this code in instances where you find yourself with a piece of text with junk numbers or something like that now there are more ways of doing this instead of just giving slash d you have another way of specifying numbers so within brackets like the square brackets like this you can give zero small hyphen and nines which would again represent numbers and if you do this you would get the same output all right and instead of your g you can just go for slash d plus which means one or more so one or more instances of this would be removed okay but unfortunately this plus symbol it would work if there is just one word but if there are two words this plus symbol would not work right see for hello it was removed for this it was not removed so it wouldn't work for that so instead what you have to use is you have to just still uh, give a g in here now instead of that you can just go ahead and remove the plus if you need so now that we've re looked at removing the number let's next look at extracting the number so if you'd like to extract the number what you need to do is your slash capital D now capital D represents everything other than the number so it excludes num it, it, it includes numbers and excludes everything else so now that I want to extract what I would do is I would create a new and I would name this nums because I want it inside of nums so str.replace slash capital D and global obviously replace that with your nothing so now what we would have is we would have just the number sorry i made a mistake i have to actually print out numbers like this see i'm just getting all of the numbers bunched together it even removed the space extra space so, so that's how it happens and again you can use 0 to 9 in here as well but again we don't need 0 to 9 so what would we do instead so instead you have to place the caret symbol right before this which means remove everything other than 0 to 9 okay so that will work and also instead of the replace you can actually use your match as well so instead of replace just ask for match so just ask for match and in here let them know that you want all of the digits globally and you want them printed out okay now why don't we print out the result of this inside of our dom so we don't really have to look for this over and over right so i'm going to create a bunch of okay this is going to be for the string and another h2 which is going to have the id for the numbers or just num like this all right that's it and go back here and in here let's let's get the element so there you go str let str element is equal to document dot get element by id so we are getting the element by its id which is str in the first case and and then we are getting the number element as well again document dot get element by id now this would be num right and then what we are going to do is we are going to replace the inner text of this so str l dot inner text the first one would be original string is str like this and then similarly next we are going to create nums like this 
and we are going to do the match that I told you about, right? So I'm just showing you a different way of doing the same thing. Right, so the same match and then num element dot inner text would be extractor numbers is num. It was nums, sorry. Now, now let's look at the output. There you go, see? So original string is this and extracted numbers is this. Now if you see there is a comma separated. Okay, before we got just the string, now we are getting comma separated and that's because it's now a an array. So you can consider this an array and you can work with it like that. So that's it for this particular tutorial. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like this video and please subscribe to the channel. I'll be posting a video every single day and I'll be posting a lot of answers to the questions that you probably have in your programming journey. And I would love to hear your comments. I'll try to reply to as many of them as possible. But please, please send me your comments, your asks, your doubts. You can ask them, ask any of them. So please subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Thank you.